Hey guys, I don't have the universe plugin for Sony Vegas. Sorry about the X. Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Sorry I didn't upload last week, but here's a video for this week. So in this video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do a split screen on the Y axis. Pretty easy. Nothing too complicated. A beginner can do this. So let's get into it. So I already have my clips preloaded in here. Now I'm going to drag motion tile into both of them. I'm going to change these to 400, 400 mirror edge copy this paste that so what most people might do is just duplicate this waste of time i don't like doing it so what i do first is i come here to this little button that choose grid and guide options turn on proportional grid come up here to the rectangle tool or you can press q so then you just want to yo what is that all right give me one sec i, I have stroke on for some reason <laughs> Okay, now you come here, right? And then now you just drag, go to the middle. We're not on the clip. All right, there we go. And that's what it should look like. So now you got that, right? Now, in order to get the other half, what you can do is now you duplicate it. Click M, invert it. Perfect. And you're going to want to do the same thing here. Instead of actually doing the mask again, you can just copy it from the original. Put that one here. Duplicate that. Oops. Yeah, duplicate this layer. And then do the same thing. Invert it. Now we can turn our proportional grid. So if we do that, test it. I think it's perfect. Let's try it on here. Yeah, we're good. So now we're going to open up our position now i'm going to mark the y-axis i'm going to do this one right here for both of them and so these are the values that i use so starting off at the bottom we're going to put 1165 for y position we're going to put negative 165 as well as negative 165 here and then 1165 here so let's play this i don't know if you ask me that looks great but we're missing one thing we need to do the graphs so i'm going to highlight all of the keyframes and i'm going to easy ease these easy ease these you can do f9 or just right click on it wait yeah right click keyframe assistant easy ease, right so for this one i'm going to do I'm going to just do a little cheat. I'll show you guys the graphs. I like these graphs. Whoops. Here we go. So that's what the top layer will look like. If you want both of them. It's going to look something like this. Here we go. Alright, and I'm going to do the same thing here. I'll show you guys this graph as well. So for this, the top one, it's going to look something like this. For the bottom, it's going to look something like this. It's going to be the exact same thing on here, just inverted. So let's open this as well. So here we go. Can open up both of them. Look, from a nice little um, little diamond. I mean, if you turn your head like a kite, yeah. So there you go. There you have it. There's your uh, split screen. On the y-axis fairly simple real easy to do the x-axis basically the same way if you guys want i can make a tutorial on that you know which i just might you know it's just using the x-axis just same steps but i'll put it i'll put a tutorial up on that next week all right i hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial if you guys if it did help you leave a comment and leave a like and also consider subscribing it really means a lot to me I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.